Alright, what's up ladies and gentlemen, this is Survival Horror Entertainment back at you with another video yet again and in this video I'm going to be testing another build and I'm hoping this is the build that actually gives Freddy a true chance in this game. So, let's just go ahead and get into the perks. So, number one, I'm going to be using Play With Your Food. And the reason I'm going to be using Play With Your Food is for multiple reasons. Hey, what's up, Mason? Number one. All right. Whenever I look at Freddy's snares, it says it decreases their movement speed by 15%, right? So, I was there thinking to myself, huh, Play With Your Food speeds you up by 15%. So, it slows them down by 15% and speeds you up by 15% if you get three stacks of play with your food right so i was also thinking about the early game and I'm, you know without red paintbrush freddy's dream world is absolutely useless so what i'm going to be doing is i'm combining red paintbrush with play with your food so that way hopefully if i find my obsession early i can get them early game stacks start everybody in the dream world get instant use out of my dream snares by slowing them down and and uh speeding myself up so these two actually accompany each other complement each other very well you know so i'm also going to need information of where to teleport to so if I get a hook this don't require a scourge hook you know so even if I don't get to a scourge hook you know I still have the information of where to teleport to unless they're using distortion or something like that and I'm gonna be combining that with pain resonance if they don't let go of a generator while I'm teleporting or when I get the, a scourge hook then you know this will instantly block the generator with dead man switch i'm going to be combining class photo with dead man switch so that way it makes every generator spew blood i have the information of where they are and if they let go um it blocks the generator and if they don't let go it still blocks one of the generators so that is the the concept of the build for everything to have synergy with one another Hey, what's up, uh, Buzzard? I wish I could play Dead by Daylight, but I don't got a TV, so that sucks. Yeah, that really sucks. All right, so enough of that. Let's just go ahead and see how this build goes, and hopefully it does what I need it to. So not only does Play With Your Food benefit the snares and actually make the snares worth using, it also speeds you up in the chase to get that hit that you need. However, my downside is windows and pallets. That's my biggest downside to the build is they can literally loot me to death. You know, but play with your food. Hopefully it helps. It will help me in the chase, speed me up in the chase. You know, so I do have to rely on my snares as I normally should. Maybe it's good you don't have a TV, you watch other people suffer instead. Yeah. Alright, so we got that, that. Okay, no TTVs that I'm aware of. But we do have a map, so this survivor with the right combination of add-ons can show everybody where all the generators are and everything else. So, let's just see where it goes and wish me best of luck. Hopefully these survivors will ready up. Please God, let this build be worth it. I really want I'm I've been searching for that one Freddy build. That's what I've been searching for all this time and all these test builds and test runs. I've been searching for the right build for Freddy. So play with your food definitely is a must-have to make the snares worth using dead man switch gets the most benefit out of his teleport and um, Hooking a survivor on a scourge hook pain resonance not hooking them on a scourge hook information. Let's go She's bringing a map for a boon definitely wouldn't surprise me It's still the biggest slap in the face though the boons in comparison to the hex one chance hex versus indefinite boons that's kind of irritating all right 
this will be my first match, my warm-up match, my rest bucket match. So if I perform poorly, don't judge too harshly, as always. And let's see where this goes. Please just let this build do what I hope it does. I really hope this is the build I've been looking for. Oh boy, if I find my obsession early, I'm going to be so happy. Dead Dog Saloon. Alright, let's get it. Alright, so I'm over here, so they're probably over here. Nope. Okay. Well, it's nice that we found somebody early. However, it's not my obsession, so she has the advantage right now. All right, there we go. Now she's going to hop her ass in a window. Oh, my God. I thought that was the fucking vault. Oh, fuck. Thank God she messed up. Oh, thank you. That, sh that could still be a generator, though. Oh, thank God, a scourge hook. Come on, just let me make it before the gen gets done. Yes! This is not my obsession, so she once again has the advantage. All right, there we go. I need to get to that survivor. Come on. Oh, fuck. I forgot to break the the walls. Wait a minute. That's Jane. Mm. Jane, please be Jane. Yes. Give me my stack, thank you. All right, let me catch back up to Jane. I might have enough time to get two stacks. Yes, I wanna head back to that generator. Can I get my stack, please? All right, two stacks. Damn it, place the fucking thing. Okay, thank goodness. Play with your food. Thank you. Ah, Damn it. I need to make it to this fucking scourge hook. Come on. Get on it. Get off my gin. Okay, good. Sorry, right. I'll get another stack off of Jane. All right, that's two stacks. I've got enough to keep up. I need to break this right now. There we go. Damn, this is actually going pretty good. That's all right. I'll go ahead and get that out of the way. I'm going to go ahead and kick this. I'm going to teleport back to that gin it was working on. Kick this. All right. Oh. I need to get over here to this generator. I'm going to break this right now. This generator is almost done. I need to break this stupid boon. I need to break this. God damn. Oh yes, touch it. There 
There we go. Got the hit. All right, I've still got enough stacks to catch up. Damn it, what am I doing? Well, that's one completed, come on. Come on. Thank God. All right, come on, Pain Resonance. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Let go of the other one. Yes. It's working. I'm just going to go ahead and break this. All right, there we go. All right, I got another scourge hook. Yes, damn. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it, I don't got my teleport yet. She let go, beautiful. Let go of that gin. Oh yes, it's Jane. All right, let me meet her on the other side, hopefully. Oh, that's fine. I still got a stack anyway. All right, I've got enough to catch up. Actually, I don't want to use that yet. I hate how long it takes to place a goddamn snare. Yes! See what I mean? Play with your food, baby, let's go! Come on. Okay, come on, come on, come on. What the fuck? Pick her up, you stupid game. Yes. Boom. Okay, they're headed to that generator. That's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and break this. Let go of those gins. Where'd she go? I know that. Okay, the. Damn, they almost completed the gin. There we go. I'm gonna let her go because I need to kick this generator. I don't care if they complete that one. Oh, thank you. Come here. Damn, she messed up. Come on. There we go. That's where Jane is. Alright. There we go. Alright, that'll give me a stack. There we go. You know, that'd be cool if we can catch back up to her and get two stacks. Alright, come on. All right, come on. 
Okay, well, fuck it. We already got a stack. We're good. Oh. All right, there we go. I need to go ahead and break this. Jane, where are you? I just saw you. Okay. That's fine. We need to put a little bit of fear in her anyway. Come on. Boom. Well, hello there. That missed? All right, fuck that. Thank you. Gotta break this. And I don't might as well go, just go ahead and break all this shit. I need to get back to that gin that's most progress. There we go. Okay. This is dead zone, baby. Oh, wow. All right, there we go. Let's get it. All right, here we go. All right. Man, this is actually going beautiful. This is actually going really damn good. Ooh. I'll go ahead and break it. I'm just, I'm breaking it because I don't have any stacks to play with your food. So you might as well just get it out of the way. All right, there we go. Here we go. Boom. Let go of that. All right. Get your speed boost. Thank you. All right, they got shadow step. go there we go you know what I might as well just go ahead and get one more off of her damn these boons dude these boons are fucking ridiculous. They can just place the fucking things indefinitely. Come here. There we go. That's what I wanted. Hey, how you doing? All right, there we go. Now we're... I've got a need for speed. <laughs> All right, they're probably headed to this one. All 
All right, there we go. It actually is. It is Super Freddy activated. <laughs> All right, that one's been regressed. That one's not progressed enough. If it is, they're probably working on this one. No? Wow. Okay, they were all healing. Well, both of them anyway. That's all right by me. The obsession has basically already exhausted her usefulness to me. All right, Jane. You can't outrun me. Thank you. I appreciate the speed boost. Oh, yes. Don't it feel good when snares are useful? Damn, I love it. <laughs> All right, so this survivor's hiding. Yeah, I agree. That's going to be really irritating. All right, so this is where she more than likely kills herself on hook. Yep. Kill yourself on the hook to give the survivor a free escape. Here it comes the hatch. Time to get screwed over. All right, not there. Okay, it's got to be over here then. There it is. All right, I'm going to head to this one. And I'm going to place a snare on it. Not that it really matters considering the fact that she's awake. Hopefully I'll be fast enough to get across the map. But if not... It's all right. We still got a 3K. Oh, she fell back asleep. Let's go. All right. All right. Oh, you thought you was fast enough to run away? Yeah, let me help you. Oh my god, I love it. I love it so much. This might be the build, boys. I should be able to make that hook. I should be able to make this. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Oh, well, I'm still gonna get the fucking win anyway. Thank you. All right, to the basement we go. There we go. Damn. Now that was badass. You're never going to be able to hook somebody on an indoor map with the new wiggle mechanic and somebody using boil over. It wouldn't surprise me. Like, I don't get where they think 100% sway is, is uh, going to be a good thing. All right, so they had 
Shadow Step, Boon, Lithe, Exponential, Windows, Lithe, Unbreakable, Boon, Alliance, that actually helped me. Wiretap, Resilience, Potential Energy, Boil Over, Resilience, Prove Thyself, and Adrenaline with a single map. Yeah, I definitely think this did really damn good. What does everybody else think? <clears throat> it's going to be RPD with boil over all, all over again. Remember that? Yeah, I remember that. That was lame. People were like literally just going to the very top just, just because you couldn't do nothing about it. I, the build did great. This build actually, it actually did better, better than I thought it would. Wow, this was actually amazing. I'm hoping to see, I'm hoping this is his best build. I'm really hoping that this is his build. I think call up Brian for barbecue is the final piece of the cake because the 40 meter weakness. Do you know a good build for Pinhead? Yeah, I know a good build for Pinhead. Whenever I start playing uh, Pinhead, I'll put it on display, but I got to get better as Pinhead. I'm not going to lie. I'm not the best Pinhead, but I do. I have been working on a build for him. You know, um, something that benefits his power. You know, it's so funny to me because Pinhead isn't even really about, you know, um, the gins or anything. He's more about his box. Like, dude, if you can keep that box going, they can't do a gin. It, that is his strength, his chain hunt. He had, Pinhead has one of the most powerful abilities in the game. That's why that's why the box is uh, so easy to complete. That's why the box is so easy to find. Is because he literally, in my opinion, has the best map control power in the game. Hey, what's up? Uh, I don't even know how to pronounce your name. But hey, what's up, uh, Merrick? Yeah. Yeah, like I said, Merrick, I'm not going to say what my build is for him, but, you know, I've been testing here and there uh, while testing builds for Freddy. Two Ashes, Kate, and Nia. All right. All right. All right, let's hope this build continues doing what it's doing. Yeah, once you know the box spawn pinhead is nasty, I agree. He's one of the best killers in the game if you can keep finding the box. Alright. Uh, Alright. Let's see how this match goes. Let's hope this uh, match goes just as good as the first one. But so far, the build did really good on Dead Dog Saloon. Let's see what it does on the more survivor-sided maps. That's what I'm really trying to find out, is what it will do on the survivor-sided RNG. Okay. Because if this build keeps up with survivors on survivor sided RNG, this might be the build. This might be the build I've been looking for. If it keeps up with that. But we'll find out. Rotten Fields. This has got some super safe loops. Let's see where it goes. Damn it. They made sure I couldn't get my early teleport. <laughs> okay, one generator here, one there, three over here in this direction. So they usually spawn near gins. Here we go. Give me my stack so I can catch up. 
Thank you. That's fine by me. Wasting God power early. Let's go. All right. So now I want to go. Now that she got all that distance, I'm going to go back over here to the gin. There we go. All right, there we go. That's all right. Dead hard saving a survivor once again for playing sloppy. That's normal. I'm about to lose a generator any minute. Wow, I played myself. <laughs> I can't even place my snare. Ain't that beautiful? Another generator completed. That's why I don't like messing with Kill Shack. You know, some loops are just uh, too safe. And that's exactly what those loops are, is too safe. Oh, thank God, a scourge hook. Come on. All right, that's one. I know she's over here. All right, there we go. I'm not worried about him. I need to get back to these gins. <laughs> oh, thank you, Pain Resonance. Save me. I might as well just go ahead and kick this. I'm gonna go ahead and use my teleport now. Kick this right now. Go for the unhook. Please let it be my obsession. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, he interacted with an object. Ah! Oh, get mine game. Oh, yes, a scourge hook. Thank God. Bro. Wait. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and break this. Mm, I, I got, I'm stupid. There we go. I deserve that.
You know what? Nah, I gotta get back to the gins. That shit's too safe. Yep, too safe. That's what I hate about these loops, dude, on this on this kind of shit, dude. They're too fucking safe. Take this, give me my stack. All right. <laughs> okay. I'll take it. All right, give me my scourge hook. Thank you, Barbecue and Chili. Let's go. There we go. Let's go. No scourge hook. All right, that's fine. We'll just take her over here. We'll get the information. Okay, they're not working on a gin. That's nice to know. All right, actually, no, this is too safe. That's too safe. I ain't got no stacks to counter that. That, that would be stupid for me to go there. All right, thank you for the stack. All right, now I've got the stack to catch up. All right, there we go. <laughs> she, I don't know, I think she panicked or something. There we go. Oh, thank you, Ash. Now I've got my stack to catch up. You know what? For this loop, I want two. I'm going to go for two stacks. All right. Now I'm going to head back to her because now I have enough stacks to actually shut down that loop with my snares. Yeah. Oh, don't it feel fucking beautiful, baby? Oh, it feels fucking beautiful to be to get value out of my snares with play with your food. All right, I'm gonna just teleport across the map. Not here. <laughs> Hello, Ash. I'm gonna get my stack. There we go. Look at that. One stack, baby. One fucking stack could have caught him. Alright, now that I got two... <laughs> this feels beautiful, dude. 
This feels good for a change. Okay, she's awake. I get no... You know what? You know what? Slam it. There we go. Alright, that's fine by me. Not here. I don't want to use my teleport yet. Not here. She just fell asleep. Hmm. You know, have you ever seen survivors scared like this? Okay, thank you. I'll get my stack back now. <laughs> I'm liking this, bro. I'm actually liking this. Yes, give me my third stack. Let's go. Oh, uh, that's all right. I'll catch up. I'm on my way, baby. Oh, you're asleep. You ain't going nowhere. This is my world, and you can't ever leave. Did you think you were fast enough to stop me? Let's go! Let's go! Off of my generator! Headed to Kill Shack, got it. Bam! Let's go! Damn, this feels good! Alright, now, give me my stack. Well, give me my pain resonance. You know what? If he ain't gonna wiggle, I might as well just wait for pain, um, Dead Man Switch to come back. Here we go. Well, hello there. Ah. Bro, this was fucking beautiful. And 4K, baby. Oh, no, you don't. You're not getting... Oh, yes. 4K. Let's go! You went up against a Freddy today? Very nice. Alright, we got a rank already. Alright, so let's see what we were going up against. I wonder if we... No? We got Dead Hard, Adrenaline, Unbreakable, Kindred, Self-Aware, Resilience, Overcome, and I was fast enough to catch up. Oh, that's beautiful. Tenacity, Boil Over, Unbreakable, Off the Record, Life, and I was fast enough to catch up. Dead Hard, Unbreakable, Kindred, and Adrenaline. So, we got Adrenaline and Adrenaline, Unbreakable, 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 Off the Record, Resilience, Huh. This might be my Dream Master build. I might make this my Dream Master build. If this keeps doing this, if this keeps doing this, <laughs> you bet your ass. Let's go. We already got a rank in two matches. Hell, if I get another Merciless, I'll be another rank. I mean, I do get why people, some people run to exhaustion perks, depending on the map. You know, some maps would benefit, benefit another exhaustion perk, whereas another perk would benefit another map. You know, that's why some people bring two, because they don't know what map they're going to get. Uh -huh. 
This is going good. Like, bro, this is feeling good right now. All right, two med kits. We got a YouTuber. King Nickel YouTube. Damn, bro. I really hope this keeps going the way it's going, dude. Like, we're finally getting a build that gets results. Yeah, I get it, but personally, just one perk will do for you. Oh, yeah? Let's go. Man, who would have thought play with your food food would be a perk for Freddy? Who would have who would have thought? Like I can't believe all this time I've been overlooking play with your food on Freddy. I never considered the dream snares slowing survivors down. And play with your food speeding you up, allowing you to get value out of your anti-loop. Like, all this time, I've been overlooking that. Hey, man, 4K Freddy, that was a meme, right? That was the meme going around among the comp players, 4K Freddy, ha ha. Alright, let's let's hope this build keeps doing good. Like, I'm really liking this build so far though. Freddy's lunge is mad. Not really. He's got the he's got the same lunge as uh the hag. I mean <clears throat> I don't get where his lunge range is insane. He's got the same as uh some of the other killers in the game. All right, I see a wall that I gotta break already. All right, just head towards, just head towards Kill Shack, and I'll find somebody. I gotta break this. What the fuck? I'm teleporting backwards. Hey, right, come on now. I've been. Oh, Kate. Are you my obsession? Nope, but I need to get this survivor off the gin. Whoa! Bro. Dude, something ain't right about this match. You're telling me my stream is doing perfectly fine, but I'm teleporting backwards? Come on now. If this was an internet issue, why is it... Um, what? What the fuck, dude? What the fuck just happened? What's going on with this match? This is weird, dude. I'm honestly about to not even count this match. Like, if this keeps up... If this... Are these people cheating? Bro, are these people cheating? Bro, what? I'm about to not even count this match, dude. I'm really not.
Okay. Yeah, this this is one of those uh, loops that are way too strong. I need to find another. Like I like I said, dude. Like I'm not even about to count this match because of that bullshit at the beginning. Because of that start. Like that start, like straight fucked me, dude. Like I had a good start, and then all of a sudden, oh, just teleport. Like what the fuck? Come here. This is... Yeah, I want to play like that. Get off that gin. I just saw them... I just had an aura read. Like, what the fuck? Where the fuck is this stupid thing? This is this match is just feeling really off to me. Like, I know what that survivor's doing. That's why I'm not chasing. That's why I'm not chasing that survivor. She knows what she's doing. Mm, yeah. No. I can't mess with it. That shit, that'll be wasting too much time. I gotta keep juggling these motherfuckers. If they're gonna... Like, this map has actually really got some bullshit loops, not gonna lie. What? These people definitely know each other. 100%. Yeah, these people know each other. Randoms don't come, randoms don't move in like that. Okay, I'll take that. Thank for thank you for the stack. Now I should have enough stacks to catch up to her, but I know they want to do that gin. This survivor's just gonna keep abusing this loop. You notice how that survivor just keeps going back to that loop. That survivor knows that loop is busted. <laughs> Boy, talk about a crutch. You gotta love crutch perks, man. This shit, dude. Dude, the loot, the RNG that I've got is so fucking survivor sided, it's not even funny. Oh. <sighs> 
this is why I don't go to Kill Shack. This is why I don't mess with people at Kill Shack. For that reason. It's just a waste of fucking time, dude. You might you're better off not going at you not you might as well just letting the chase go. Oh, thank you. That play with your food. I, I don't know if it was, that was play with your food or not. Come on. God damn, this RNG is so fucking survivor sided. I know there's a survivor over in this direction. I know there's two survivors in this direction, or one's going for the unhook, I know that. Like, like I said, dude, that, that beginning fucked me over so hard. I'm not even worried about this match. And now I don't have any stacks to stop this. So I'm actually just kind of wasting my time. And now I'm back at the kill shack. Completely survivor sided loot. 100% in survivor's favor. Can they please stop playing this music so fucking loud I can't hear shit? My dude. All right, I should be fast enough to catch up. There we go. And let me guess, another pallet. And now she can just pre-drop. And go pallet to pallet, pre-dropping and pre-dropping and pre-dropping. And there ain't shit the killer can do about it. I left her alone because I gotta get back to these gins. Like this one right over here. Wow. Okay, talk about a stroke of luck, dude. Oh, thank God. Please let me, let me make it in time. All right, there's somebody close by. Yeah, that's exactly what that means. There's somebody close by. Yeah, there's there's one or there's one or two survivors very close by. I have no reason to leave. There we go. That survivor knows. That Cheryl is probably the better survivor on their team. She knows that loop is busted, so she just keeps abusing it. Come on, come on, come on. Let me get that let me get that pain res. The only thing really keeping me in the game. If 
Thank you, Dead Man Switch. Like I said, this survivor's just gonna run back to that loop over and over and over again. I'm only, I'm just keeping her away. Like I said, I'm not worried about her because I know what she's doing. She's just going to keep abusing that loop over and over. She knows it's busted. I should have got my stack off of her first, but I need pain resonance to keep me in the game. Get that pain res wait. I'm waiting for dead men switch. There we go. Alright, there we go. Bam. Alright, that's regressing. All right, I know they're working on this gin up here. They're gonna let the obsession die. Or are they? Are they gonna let the obsession die to screw me over? I wonder if that's what they're gonna do. If they're gonna screw me out of play with your food by letting her die. Ooh. All right. I was just wanting to check up on that generator. There you are. I'm not worried about you, bitch. I'm not stupid to your game. That's all right. I'm letting them go, so that way they'll go heal. Give me my stack of play with your food, thank you. Bam! Alright, if I can just find my obsession and get that second stack, that'd be beautiful. I'm actually... I'm actually making a comeback. Okay, not messing with. They probably, let me check this. Nope, they want that one specific generator out of the way. And it's still regressing, thank goodness. Not messing with it, they want this one. I screwed myself. Oh wait, the obsession's here. I'm gonna go ahead and break this and get this out of the way. Ooh. 
All right, that I don't have to worry about that one because it hasn't been regret, uh, progressed enough. All right, thank you for the second stack. Not worried about her. <laughs> All right. All right, I should have enough speed to get back over there. Thank you. Come on, pain res, baby. Let's go. Even in a... Nice try. Still got a tie game. I literally turned a complete loss into a tie game. Like, I literally started off bad and still got a tie game. I'm not mad about that. Like, I don't know what happened at the beginning, but... Your thoughts on Survivor Main still wanting Lightborn nerf? I really don't care. I really don't care if it does get nerfed. Like, it's a meme. Bro, this build is a beast. This is a beast mode build. Look at this shit, dude. Like, they're salty. Bro, these survivors are so salty right now. Like, they're literally refusing to leave. They're literally trying to troll me. And I'm sorry, but um, a tie game ain't exactly you doing great. But it's whatever to me. Nah, you don't need this. Yeah, you can leave. Look at this, this Cheryl is so fucking salty, dude. Yep. She's just being salty about it, that's all. See, look. That survivor is not very happy. <laughs> But it's okay by me. Let's see. Cheryl had Iron Will, Flashbang, Dead Hard, Aftercare, Boon, Shadow Step, Resilience, Iron Will, Dark Theory, Off the Record, Overcome, and Reassurance. Thank God for Play With Your Food. I had the ability to catch up. Decisive Strike, Dead Hard, Off the Record, and Resilience. So, Resilience... Resilience, off the record, off the record, dead hard, overcome, dead hard. Yeah, all right. Not bad for turning that match around. That was actually pretty good. Turning that into a tie game with that early, that dude, that, I don't know what the hell was going on at the beginning of that match, but like, you saw what happened where, um, like the survivor literally just like teleported away i was like what 
You know, that's what threw me off. That's, you know, and that was costing me hard. You know, so, you know, that that actually would have been a win if um, the beginning hadn't have been messing up the way it did. All right, let me grab something from my uh, room real quick, and we'll get back into this. Bro, this might become my new official Freddy build. If it keeps going like this, bro, this is about to become my new official Freddy build, my Dream Master build. All right, so hold on just one second, and I will start it. Okay. Sorry about the wait. So, uh, chat, what's everybody thinking about this build so far? Everybody liking the build? What's everybody's opinion? Yeah, that's what I thought, too. It seems to be holding up. Like, bro, if this keeps going like this, like I said, I will make this my official build. If it keeps going like this. All it took was, like, damn near 100 videos of testing to figure it out. I wonder if this is how they intended Freddy to play. You know, the play with your food with Dead Man's Switch. I wonder if they intended that. When are you playing Freddy with Devour Hope again? Probably never. Not until they make totems worth using. Like, totems are only good on high mobility killers. And that's it. Ooh, a flashlight. Got it. <sighs> but still, that was pretty nasty for a 2K. To turn a to turn a bad match around into a 2K, that was legit. To turn a complete loss into a tie game is legit, dude. Hey, uh, what's up, you, um, loafy girl? Hey, what's up?
Let's hope this build keeps putting in work. All right, let's go. Oh, yay. A straight-up survivor-sided map. Let's go. Here's a great idea. Let's give a fucking football stadium for a map. I'm doing... Nah, yeah, you're kind of late. I've already played, like, two or three matches. All right, head towards Kill Shack. Exactly what I thought. Just who I wanted. Now I should have the stack I need to catch up. She's out of position. Was out of position. Wow, they're not stupid. Holy shit. Damn. Okay. We're not playing against idiots. Wait, what? Where'd that other survivor go? My there you are. Got one injured. <laughs> All right. All right, there we go. got a stack to possibly catch up we're going against those fucking survivors that ain't playing around they definitely know each other <laughs> all right come on I'm about to lose a gin if I lose this is like you know just in case people don't know like an extremely survivor-sided map. Come on, move your ass! Oh! Does anybody realize just how sexy that was? Damn it! Drop down, motherfucker! Chill the fuck out. Yeah. Can I place my fucking snare, please? Where the fuck she go? Quick and quiet. This is a this is a coordinated foreman. Holy shit, dude. Think about casual survivors, right?
think about the casual survivors, right? The game needs to be nerfed. The killers need to be nerfed so casuals can keep up. Jesus fucking Christ. That'll be another gin. This is a big mistake. Yep. I'm letting that go because I got to. Like I said, it's a coordinated four man, dude. And people keep telling you, think about the casuals. I don't fucking go against casuals. I don't give a fuck about casuals. Why the fuck would I care about something I don't go against? Gotta break it. Too safe. The entire map is too fucking safe. <coughs> Dude, this map is safe as fuck. This map is too big. Like, straight up. I'm not even worried about it, dude. This map is way too safe. Way too safe. <laughs> Come on, teleport. <laughs> wow. Jesus Christ. See you later, Lofty girl. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 100%. This is a coordinated four, man. Hey, man. So, some survivors you just can't beat, bro. Some survivors you just can't beat. For one, this map is way too big for you to actually do anything. Yeah, this map is super fucking safe. Just cheat me out of my grab. Coordinated four men. That's coordinated four men's for you, dude. You just can't do nothing versus them. <coughs> now you're starting to get a clear image of why I say, um, why I mock those people who keep saying, think about the casuals. There wasn't shit casual about that match, bro. <coughs> so let's see what they beat me with. Let's see. Overcome. Which I was able to catch up to, but the map was safe. The map RNG is 100% survivor-sided, unless you're playing a range killer. 
Let's see, Kindred, Dead Hard, Prove Thyself. Oh, Dead Hard, Adrenaline, Prove Thyself, Unbreakable. Dead Hard, Aftercare, Prove Thyself, Adrenaline. Balance Landing, Prove Thyself, Quick and Quiet and Vigil. So, so real question. Um, was I playing wrong? Because I highly doubt I was. And uh, let's see. Survivors say we don't need gin perks or gin speed slowdown. So they got that nerfed. They got our generator perks nerfed. And then the thing that I find funny is prove thyself has yet to get nerfed. You know, that 30% increase to gin speeds with three survivors on, on one generator. You know, prove thyself, prove thyself, prove thyself, prove thyself. Let's see. Dead hard, dead hard, dead hard. <laughs> adrenaline, adrenaline. Like, come on, dude. That's a coordinated four men. That right there is the difference between casual survivors and coordinated four men SWF. And then the survivor community tells you, but, 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 that's the 5% of the community. You don't come across those survivors that often. The fact that you come across them is enough. <laughs> like, bro. <laughs> but <clears throat> what really, it wasn't even that, um, that the survivors were overpowered. What the issue with that map is, is that the map is too, it, it is too big. <clears throat> Think about that. There is no killer in the game other than a range killer, like Huntress, something like that. There is no killer. Leatherface, he ain't going to be fast enough. Um, you look at most of the killers in the game, they're not going to be fast enough to stop a team like that. And that's what's, that's the problem with Dead by Daylight. That's why survivors choose Area of Crows. That's why they choose Mother's Dwelling. That's why they choose this new shattered bullshit map. You know, if you notice, survivors dwell on huge maps because the killer has to take a super long amount of time to get across the map. So, that map completely favors them. For one, it's, it's a goddamn stadium. It's the size of a stadium. And um, they've got a pallet at every corner that leads to an LT wall s covered in pallets. The, the map is huge as fuck and covered in pallets and LT walls. Like, I don't, I don't understand these developers with their concept of uh, map design. Like, small maps are usually killer-sided. Uh, big maps are 100% survivor-sided. Medium maps are kind of the in-between that can go either way. You know, a 50-50. Because it's not too big. It's not too small. Survivors can get places quickly. Killer can get places quickly. And, you know, they can loot. And and you, you have time to actually get across the map. Whenever you get a map that's too big, you know, the killer has little to no time to get across the map. <clears throat> I have yet to win a game as killer on the new map. I have, but it was versus shit survivors. <coughs> like, if you if you lose as survivors on that map, either one, you're really bad as a team, or two, you win in solo queue. That's the only two options. Uh, losing on the new map. <clears throat> it's either a really bad four man or a solo queue that loses on shattered. Coordinated four mans that actually that actually know what they're doing. Well, I think we just saw those results. Do you like Plague? Um, she's interesting to me. I kind of think she's borderline overpowered in a, in a way. But <clears throat> because she has a power with no counterplay. <coughs> like if you if you don't cleanse, you you're a one hit down, and if you do cleanse, you give her anti loop. So. Like, if you actually look at that, like, the survivors are getting punished if they do and if and getting punished if they don't. So, that's my opinion on Plague. Alright. Maybe we'll get a more fair map. A more, less survivor-sided map. <clears throat> I 
Like Huntress on the new map, she'll do good. But even even with her range, you know, there's she's still not gonna get across the map fast enough to actually stop the gins. Not versus a coordinated team, she's not. <clears throat> That's why she's A tier and not S tier. <clears throat> All right. Let's try this again. Maybe we will get a less bullshit map. Like my build, I, w I was playing correctly. It's just... The map was too big. And that's literally all it was. If survivors want to win, if a coordinated four man wants to beat you, they will. We're playing as Freddy, if a coordinated team wants to beat you, they will. <clears throat> Mother's Dwelling, another survivor sided map because of the size. Let's go. Like, look how big this fucking map is, dude. Like, even even though I can teleport across the map in three seconds, I'm still not fast enough. I could get 120 to 130 percent movement speed and still not be fast enough. All right, so I got about what? 60 50 seconds to to do something <clears throat> not nah, that's too strong <clears throat> nope I can't fuck with that not early game not like that nope never go for kill shack early like that unless you're going against dumbasses Wait, what? All right. And I've got a stack. <clears throat> wow, auto aim, I love you. Bro, these bitches have no fear. Look at this. They have no fucking fear. <laughs> Thank you for the stack. Boy, if this ain't a bullshit loop. Fuck it. <clears throat> can't catch the bitch. I can't catch the bitch, dude. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. See what I mean about this uh, chase game? If survivors don't make mistakes, you don't get a hit. You don't get it down if they don't mess up. Gotta waste time breaking this. Still got a gin completed. Damn. I think it's safe to say we don't go against scrubs on my channel. 
Well, unless they play like that. But overall, I left her alone because I gotta protect the gin. No! Still completed it. See the type of survivors I go against? And then people tell me think about the casuals. Wow. And healed before I could even get there. Holy shit. That is amazing. That is fucking mind blowing to me. The type of the caliber of survivors I get. You, this guy is literally the weak link of the crew. Like, dude, <laughs> it is ridiculous the type of shit I have to go against. I'm wasting my time here. I'm not fucking with it. It's too safe. <clears throat> you know what? I'm gonna go for this guy. I don't give a fuck. I gotta get this guy. He's like the weak link of the crew. Thank you. Get your free distance. Mm -hmm. There would be... Damn it, fucking environment! Told you he's the weak link of the crew, that's why I did this. I'm getting him out early because if I don't, I ain't gonna get a kill. Let go of my gin, please. Go for that 12 hook logic versus good survivors if you want. Ah! Oh, thank God. That's why I teleported close. <laughs> Look at that shit. Don't tunnel me. Ain't that funny. Like, I, I love it when survivors say, don't tunnel me, but then they run in your fucking face. That's fucking hilarious to me, dude. Hmm. 
Let me get this fucking boon out of the way. If I don't, it's a loss. you play with your food let's go <clears throat> I don't think people realize just how fucking good play with your food is Okay. Yep. I waited for it. Okay. Look at this bullshit loot. That is, look how safe that fucking loop is. Jesus Christ. Could you make a loop any more fucking survivor sighted? Literally give, look at that bullshit. Sorry, bitch. Let me get to my obsession. I'm gonna give you something to chase, motherfucker. All right, bitch. Now you wanna you want me to chase you, motherfucker? I'm fixing to chase you. All right. Sorry. See what I mean about how safe this loop is? I told you I was gonna give you something to chase, bitch. Keep abusing bullshit loops. was so bullshit. Alright, she's currently awake. I literally had to have three stacks of prove thyself just to stop it. I mean, uh, three stacks of play with your food just to stop the damn thing. Like, that's ridiculous. I literally had to be moving at 130% movement speed just to, just to stop the damn loop. Great. Well, fall asleep, bitch. Damn, is this bitch gonna fall asleep?
Well, this is where she... Thank you. Nah, bitch. I don't fucking think so. see survivors trying to give me a free win what the fuck I'm gonna give them a free escape for she got here she got the wrong one asking for a free win bro yeah really I don't see survivors giving me no free fucking win like why the fuck I'm gonna give them a free escape Let's see. Resilience, as always. Adrenaline, as always. Boon. Distortion. Wiretap. Boon. Dead hard. Windows, as always. Desperate measures. No one left behind. Resilience. Dead hard, as always. Boon, as always. Resilience. Life. Adrenaline, as always. God damn, dude. So, real question, do you, do you guys think I'm low MMR? Do you think I'm a low MMR killer? Currently. Dead hard nerfed my ass, they buffed it. You know what's funny? I don't see any survivors messaging me GG. Damn. It's almost like they only do it when they win. Hey, what's up, Neil? I think Scott Jun is stupid. Like, personally, when he, whenever he brought up Sadako, the, the strategy, he announced, he made it very clear, without it, she's pure shit, and he's here saying, get it nerfed. I'm like, dude, how dumb can you be? You want to nerf the only strategy strategy in the game that makes her worth using? Like, what the fuck is wrong with Scott Jun, dude? You know what, my guy? Nah. I'm good. I'm not stupid. I already know what that is. Not in the mood. When you see those kind of lobbies, you back out. I don't care. When you see those kind of, like, normally I would stay, but, uh-uh. Like, I can't even make out who my obsession is. I don't think so. Yeah, they was using it. They they had a whole team of the same char same character because if I had an obsession perk, I wouldn't know who my obsession is. That's why they. That's why they had that. Hell yeah, bro. Like, fuck that. Can you blame me? You already know where that match was going. I wouldn't be able to find my obsession. They were going to choose a bullshit map, and they were going to gin rush the absolute fuck out of me. That's a lose-lose situation, my guy. Don't ever, don't ever stay in those lobbies unless you're using an S tier killer. That's the only time you you stay in those lobbies. If you've got an S tier killer, by all means, have fun. But my killer, like I said, I re I recognize and I'm I have accepted that he's not the best killer. That's why I went on ahead and backed out of that shit.
Me, I like playing killer because, in my opinion, personal opinion, I think killer takes way more skill. You know, you actually have to use your brain. Whenever I play Survivor, I just go around, hold a button, time a, time a button, run the killer around a piece of wood, slam it in his face, run to the next location, do it all over again. With killer, I gotta know, I gotta figure out where they are, where they're going, what they're doing, where's my obsession, who to hook, who to tunnel, who to camp, if I camp. You know, there's so many different things that go through my head playing as killer in comparison to playing Survivor. It's not even funny. All right, I need to go back because they're over that direction. <clears throat> Jane, you beautiful bitch. Jane, come back to daddy. Come back to daddy. All right, you know what? Oh, come here, bitch. I want you. I want you. And I'm going to have you. Thank you. That's what I wanted. At least two stacks. At minimum. Alright, you didn't expect me to catch up that quick, did you? That's alright, I can catch up. Ooh, got you, baby. Let's go. Yeah, unless you're playing nurse, bro. Still got a gin done. One hook for one gin. Jane, you beautiful. Holy shit. Dude, did you see that? They're all they're all uh on separate gins. They was all on they're all, they was all on separate gins. Alright, fuck that. I know Jane is here. Come here, bitch. Come on, fat bitch. I need to get back to this gin. Thank you for touching it. Get out of my... Thank you for touching it. Let's go. I don't care if they're going for the unhook. I need to lock down some of these gins if she if they're on one. All right, go for the unhook. Five, four, three, two, one. Unhook. Hey, how you doing? Sorry. Thank you. Thank you for being there, Jane. Now I'm fast enough to catch up. <laughs> oh. All right, now that I got him down, I'm going to come back to her. That gave her time. Okay. Ow. You motherfucker! Ah. I'm sorry, bitch. He wants to be funny. You see how he's trying to aggro me to, to keep me distracted, right? Ah. Thank you. so they're healing I 
I think I went the wrong fucking way. Damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just who I was looking for. That's all right. That's all right, Quentin. Don't you worry. I'm going to get your ass. Yeah, let's play. It's all right. I know what you want. See, I'm not stupid. I know what these survivors do. Slam it. Thank you, Jane. Hey, how you doing? Oh, don't worry. Sorry. Right. It's okay. Thank you. Kick that. Jesus Christ. You see how they keep trying me, though. I'm... <sighs> no, you don't. I know. Don't ever give survivors what they want. Ever. You give them what they want, you might as well call it GG. Thank you for the stack. You know what? Sorry, go for the unhook. Actually, fuck that. They can have that unhook. Damn. Isn't that just sexy? Damn, I love having an anti-loop that's worth a damn now. <laughs> Bro, that's bullshit. That should have been a fucking grab. You saw that shit? You saw how I got cheated out of that grab. Hey, how you doing? Come on, my guy. Thank you for the stack.
All right, Steve. I do believe you wanted to be chased ever so badly. Aw, oh, damn it, Jane. Can't you just fuck off? Give me my stack real quick. Oh, Steve. I thought it... I thought it... I, I thought it... I thought it was Quentin. Mother... No, that's Quentin, dude. That's not Steve. Bitch, you're not who I'm looking for. You are so lucky I'm not who you, you're not who I'm looking for. You're the one I want. Ain't that what you wanted? You wanted to be chased, right? Well, that's what I did. You got wish granted, motherfucker. And Jane also wanted to be chased ever so badly. So now I'm going to give you what you want. Now, this is where she gets hatched for for playing like shit. <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? Dude, see what I'm saying? You see what I'm talking about, dude? The hatch literally spawned in her ass. Bro, see what I'm saying, though? That's what I'm talking about, dude. That right there is the shit that I'm talking about. This fucking crutch ass hatch bullshit, dude. Like, I literally played everything correctly, and then the hatch literally spawns under her fucking feet. Like, how, here's an idea. If you're gonna spawn the hatch, don't spawn it right on their ass. If you're gonna spawn it, spawn it farthest away from the survivor, so that way they actually have to look for it, instead of spawning it right on them. Alright, let's see what these survivors was using. Oh, wait. Yeah. <laughs> Was that fun? Yeah, it was fun until the spa the fucking hatch spawned in her ass. It was fun up until that point. Jane should have boil over as base kit, do you think? Yeah, she should. Matter of fact, why not just buff boil over whenever that fat bitch has it so that way it just knocks the killer over? <laughs> or maybe... He or maybe he gets the hindered status effect while lifting her ass. <laughs> All right. So overall, what's everybody thinking about the build? Killer goes into the dying state. Killer gets the exhausted status effect. I know, right? <clears throat> See, once again, bro. 
You notice the survivors, they never say GG when they lose, right? You see that, right? Alright, let me grab something out of my room real quick and we will keep the show going. Okay. Alright, I'm back. Killer still, I mean, the survivor still hasn't said GG or anything. Hey, you know, you know what? That's awesome, though. Get, you know, you know that my favorite part about playing Dead by Daylight is getting to face Quentin. Is playing Freddy and finding Quentin in a match. That's my favorite part. And also, Nancy. Nancy whatever her name is nancy thompson you know since we don't have nancy hallbrook you know my replacement is nancy thompson you know so finding a quentin like my dream match is to find nancy thompson and quentin smith on bad and preschool that's my dream match nancy wheeler whatever her name is Nancy Hallbrook, Nancy Thompson, Nancy Willer, it's Nancy. It's the only Nancy we have. So, somebody's got to be my Nancy. All right, let's see what y'all saying. Would Discordance be better? No, hell no. I have tried Discordance. It's nice. But no, dude, barbecue beats the fuck out of that. Two Nancys and two Quintons would be a dream. Nah, just one Nancy, one one Quentin, one Ash, and maybe a Cheryl. Or something. You know, because for one, Cheryl's a teenager. Ash has went against Freddy in the comic books. Quentin is from the movies. And, well, Nancy, she's the only Nancy we got. Like, that would be my dream match. So, what's everybody thinking about the build so far? Seems legit still. All right. There we go. Yeah, man, like I said, it's only one loss and and a tie game because of early game bullshit. But that new map, that new map really does need to be reduced in size to at least a medium size map because that's kind of ridiculous. Even with 130% movement speed, I'm still not fast enough. Oh, I'm st I'm really starting to question if this is Freddy's best build. Like, I'm really starting to wonder. Nah, dude, that in-game shit, like, it's nice. It's a gimmick. In-game builds, like, other than no one escapes death, but... Rancor's a good perk, no one escapes death is a good perk. But that Blood Warden shit, that's a gimmick. No way out, solid. Remember me? I guess. Kinda. 
Black box needs to be buffed. Black box needs to at least have 20 seconds. 15 seconds is too short. Unless you're right at the gate when they open it. Other than that, it's garbage. Do you think Jason will come to DBD? Yes, I do. Even the even um even the dudes who's uh who was in that lawsuit, I forgot their names, but even they said they want him in Dead by Daylight. They want Jason in Dead by Daylight. So now it's just a matter of money and agreements. But we are going to get Jason eventually. Because, like I said, if the movie director and the dude who created Jason said he wants him in Dead by Daylight, we're going to get him in Dead by Daylight. As long as they can come to a financial agreement, splitting cuts, you name it. Unfortunately, strong. Yeah, I know. Remember Me is so much better on, like, Huntress. Like, Remember Me, uh, Bitter Murmur, um, you know, shit like that. It's so much better on Huntress. Jason about to be teleporting like Nurse. Um, I don't know. I think he's going to be more like Spirit. <clears throat> All right, let's get it. All right, so they're at the towards the main building. Nope, right here. Oh, is that my obsession? Come here, bitch. I just saw you. Where'd you go, bitch? Where'd she go? How'd she just disappear? Bro, like that... Whatever. I ain't got time to fucking look around. Main building. She's going to take me to the stones. Just who I wanted. All right, come back, you beautiful bitch. You're exactly who I need. Come back here. All right. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Boy, Dead Heart is such a fucking crutch perk, dude. God damn, that perk is such a crutch. I'm sick of that fucking perk. If you're gonna nerf a perk, don't fucking buff it. Stupid ass developers. Buff, boy. Let me calm down. Yeah, I had no reason to leave. Go for the unhook. Alright, good. I should be able to catch up. She fucked that loop up bad. 
Generator completed anyway. Oh, yes. I still see you. Um, anybody care to explain that shit? I'm, I'm the only thing I can assume is styptic agent. That's the only thing I can come up with. That's all, that's my best guess, is styptic agent. If that wasn't styptic agent, I'm calling bullshit. She has a superior advantage right now because I ain't got no stacks. Thank God. get to do it get out of my face I know you've got you know it's so funny like I said they tell you not to tunnel but yet they fucking run in your face with off the record but don't tunnel me Can I get my stack, please? Thank you.
Thank you for the stack. Let's see if we can find our obsession again. There we go. Fast for you. <laughs> she messed up. Wow. Wow. Jesus Christ, dude. And now, well, at least I got a tie game. All right, let's get him out of the map. That's a, still a tie game, though. Hey, what's up, Hades? Well, still got a Ruthless and a tie game on top of that. All right, let's see what we was going against. We're going to Lithe, Wiretap as always, Adrenaline as always, Distortion, oh, Adrenaline, Adrenaline, Deja Vu to find gins, Overcome, but I was fast enough to keep up, Prove Thyself as always, Sprint Burst, Kindred, Vigil, Off the Record as always, Sprint Burst, Off the Record as always, Self Aware and Windows of Opportunity as always. And yeah, I was right. It was the Styptic Agent. All right, Commodia uh, me Mechanics Toolbox. Okay. And two med kits. Sprint burst is objectively better than Dead Hard. Bullshit. Do you know how much Dead Hard saves people's ass? Have you seen my streams? <laughs> Like, dude, Dead Heart is a fucking crutch. It's still a crutch. They didn't nerf it. They buffed it. Like, before, it used to just make you miss the hit. Now, it makes you miss the hit and give and rewards them with a speed boost. So, for them to say that's a nerf, like, I would hate to see what they call a buff. So far, the build seems to be holding up quite well. Like, really good, actually. How many hours does Scott Jen have on Killer? I have no idea, but I'm starting to question it. I think me and him are going against way two different calibers of Survivor. To be honest with you. Because that sounds a lot like Survivor Main Talk. It does, and it is. If it sounds like it, looks like it, then it more than likely is. But you know what? Like I said, bro, even on that map, I still got a tie game. I'm not mad about that. I don't mind that. I just don't like getting a fucking zero K, <laughs> you know, like it's kind of ridiculous. 
Like that that new map is so bullshit. MMR Moxie uh, Scott has been doing all the adept challenges for Killer, uh, leading to a lot of out L's when he plays Killer. Bro, <clears throat> how many times do you see Scott Jen playing Freddy? Hardly ever, right? That's because everybody prefers to play a better killer. Meanwhile, I'm sticking to a trash killer and making him look good. So, that's the difference between um, a good killer, a killer player, killer main, and a bad one. Good killer mains are good with even shit killers. Scott Jun only plays like S, A tier, and B tier killers. Yeah, I mean, I've did the adept challenge for Freddy too. It doesn't mean shit. I've did, yeah, I've did the uh, adept challenge or whatever the hell it's called. I've got that. I got that shit a good while back in my um, day and night, day daytime versus nighttime survivor experiment, where I only used his three teachables. At nighttime, I got a merciless. At daytime, I got my ass whooped. I don't see the point of doing adept challenges. I just wanted to have it for my, you know, my main killer. That's that's really it. That's about all I did it for was just to say, you know, I have it. Other than that, like the challenges really don't mean nothing to me. It's not like they really give you anything. It's not like they reward you blood points or something. <clears throat> you know, more people might do them if you actually got something out of it. He wanted the achievements. I really don't care about, you know, the achievements. I got a lot of them without even trying to get them. Okay, let's see what kind of survivors we face this time. His MMR has probably sunk since he did the adept challenges. It, yeah, it really wouldn't surprise me. You know, most people, you know, have their opinions on low MMR survivors anyway. That's what they base all their opinions around for some reason. All right, Raccoon City Police Station, let's go. All right, if I spawn here, all right, so that means they're over, they should be either down there or over here, or both. Down here. I know I saw him go one up there, but all right, let's see if they're trying to take out middle first. All right. Hey, Billy. <laughs> that was actually kind of funny. I'm like, all right, my guy, you can drop it now. Uh, Bill? Okay. He must have life. No? Dead heart? Something? Oh, come on! Ooh. Yeah, dead hard. All right. I want to regress this gen some. I want to teleport. Hey, Bill, how you doing, my guy? You're exhausted now. You better slam them pallets. God damn it.
God damn, dude. Ooh, Jesus. God damn it, they would fucking pull this shit, putting all my scourge hooks away from me. Come on. Okay. Oh, she's my obsession. All right, let me catch back up to her. Okay. I need to go down here and kick this. Well, at least I have one stack. All right, number one. Still got the gin done, but that was quite a bit of time. Yep, so this is where they want to heal. Wow, holy shit, how did they get? 90 seconds, my fucking ass. Wow, cancel me out of the grab anyway. Jesus Christ, dude. That is so fucking bullshit. No scourge hook, beautiful. That is a okay. Dead hard saving their ass, crutch again. You gotta love crutch perks. Slam it. Jesus fucking Christ. So, do I go? Like everybody, I'm asking, do I go against casual survivors? Is this casual play? Is this casual play, people? What the fuck am I stuck on? Holy shit. Wow, he knew what I was doing? I guess he can just hold forward and get distance. Is this casual play, people? This don't look like casual play to me. Game over. It's game, this is a loss.
Yeah, this is a loss unless I pull this back by miracle. It's gonna take a miracle for me to come back three hooks, one gin. With no speed boost. She has the advantage in the chase at the moment. Ah! Fuck him. You know, I want a fucking scourge hook, dude. Thank you. I need one. Bill, come here, bitch. You're my only chance. Alright, you know what? Actually, fuck him. I need to get back to these gins. Boon, 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 boon. Getting sick of seeing these fucking boons. God damn it. Why did why am I not getting chase? Thank you. Come here, Bill. You ain't gonna keep holding forward, bitch. It really does leave me wondering how the fuck they can just hold forward and gain so much distance. I will get you, Bill. Come on, damn it. Bro, like, he's not even looping, he's just holding forward. Oh, yay, Dead Hard saves him. Crutch ass perk. I'm really getting sick of that fucking crutch ass perk, dude. Like, dude, that perk straight saves people's fucking ass, and I'm getting sick of it. Like, dude, that perk is so bullshit in this game. Like, it's probably a loss. Yeah, it's a loss, dude. I lost by survivors holding forward with a crutch ass perk. Fucking ridiculous, dude. <laughs> Let me guess, just hold forward to victory. Here it comes.
Come on! And... Oh, crutch ass perk for the save. You gotta love crutch perks, dude. Dude, like, this is fucking stupid. What? They're already healed? Dude, I literally went around the corner. All I did was go around the fucking corner and they're already healed? Jesus Christ, dude, this is bullshit. They know each other, dude, look at that. They're coming over here and they're coming from over here. These two are healing. Wow, already off the floor, dude. This is bullshit. The fuck out of the way, bitch! <sighs> Dude, this is bullshit. Good God, survivors are so fucking overpowered, dude. <laughs> like, they are so fucking overpowered. That is ridiculous. And honestly, that Bill's movement speed was fucking questionable, dude. No, like, straight up, like, if... I gotta see what perk they're using. Shadow step. If they don't have that one perk that, that increases their movement speed, I'm calling bullshit. Metal of man, dead hard, we're gonna live forever. Nah, dude, his movement is, hold on, let me see. Exponential, that doesn't give him an increase to movement speed. Neither does shadow step. Circle, dead hard, bond, life, distortion. Nah, dude, that's bullshit. He had nothing to increase his movement speed. I already know, I already knew it was a team. Like I said, you don't find it very, you don't find Bill's movement speed questionable at all. Like, you gotta realize I was moving at a 120% a movement speed. He was moving at 100. I was 20% faster than him. And he was just holding forward and getting away. Like, you don't find that a little, just a, a little questionable. Just a little bit. Like, if you, if you actually go back and pay attention to that chase between me and Bill, like, the dude wasn't even, like, wasting pallets or loops or, like, nothing. He was just holding forward. And he didn't, he didn't even have overcome. Nothing. He had nothing to, to boost his movement speed. Some killers cannot catch people holding forward. Like, dude, it's ridiculous. Yeah, he wasn't looking behind him. Nothing. Like, like I said, dude, I'm calling bullshit on that. And yes, I know that was a team. Hell no, I didn't have fun that fucking game. Like, it's not fun whenever you're losing versus a bitch just holding forward. You know, it's us because you can go after someone else doing the exact same thing and catch them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, bro, you're telling me I was fast enough to catch up to a life, but I wasn't fast enough to catch up to a bill holding forward. 
Like, come on, dude. That's kind of bullshit. Yeah, straight up, I'm calling bullshit on that match. Once you get to high MMR, all the subtle cheaters come out. Subtle cheaters come out. I agree. I've came across a few cheater lobbies. All right. Well, this, that one might just be loading in late. Auto dead hearts and increased movement speed. I agree. But yeah, four, four wins, two losses so far, and what, two tie games? Or a tie game? I, I don't remember. I think the build is legit so far. 100% legit. I think this might be Freddy's best build. Might be. Ooh, the game. Kill Shack. Why would you bring the game and a Kill Shack offering? That that I don't think this is a I don't think this is a four man squad. This this might be a solo queue. Because that's really questionable that somebody would bring a Kill Shack offering and the game. Killer sided map according to Ots. Dude, Ots is fucking stupid. Like he he has knowledge of the game, but if you notice, he don't play weak killers. He don't really play weak killers like that. And I swear to God, you better not tell me Trapper's weak. That motherfucker is not weak in the right hands. Trapper's actually pretty scary to go against if you know how to play him. Like, if you actually have map knowledge and know where survivors go... Trapper's dangerous. Yeah. And you could bring a build to shut down the other loops. And basically leave them with no loops at all. Just who I wanted. Not going upstairs? All right, here we go. Now I'm fast enough to catch up. Take me to your god pallets. Dead hard saving somebody yet again, crutch ass perk. As I keep stating, I keep saying it's a crutch perk. It's just this guy sucks. This guy, is, whoa, that was weird. That guy's, this Ash is uh, the weak link of the crew. I can already see that. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Alright, I might as well go ahead and kick this. Hey, how you doing? Uh, 
There it is. Damn it. The fuck is this bitch? What? Okay. Um. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Man, these survivors are fucking questionable as hell. Did my MMR drop to like zero? You ain't lying. These are definitely Ots Darva type of survivors. <laughs> um, dude, this is not what we faced just a second ago. This is. <laughs> I don't know what the hell these survivors are doing. It's really leaving me curious. I'm really wondering what these survivors are doing at this point. Well, I might as well kick this. There you are, come here. <laughs> Just the guy I want. Just who I'm looking for. Wow, and he left the God Palette? Okay. He had dead hard and I was waiting for it. Oh, hey. What? That should have been a hook. Bullshit. I literally had the option to fucking hook him and it didn't place him on the fucking thing. Yeah, wow. If I lose to this. If I lose to this. There we 
go. She knows there's a god pallet here. If I, I swear to God, dude, if I lose to trash like this. Yeah, these survivors are fucking garbage. Anyway, thank you for the stack. Never mind, she's awake. I'm not worried about it. Thank you for interacting with that. Dude, these survivors... Wow. And this RNG for my scourge hooks are so shit. Okay, they don't care. They just want to get the gins done. Yeah, I ain't worried about it. I know they want this gin. Where the fuck are their scratch marks going? Object of obsession? <laughs> Man, this RNG sucks ass. This RNG sucks ass, dude. I can't get to a fucking scourge hook nowhere. That shit's pissing me off. The fuck? Oh, 
Okay. I should have waited. Oh. All right. You know what? People ain't gonna keep. <laughs> no fear. Can I get my stack, please? Bro, this is fucking pathetic. I need to find that fucking ash. Bro! What is it with this fucking game? Give me my fucking grab! I'm getting sick of that shit. <laughs> God pallet. Oh, wow, I forgot I broke it. <laughs> Bro, I swear to God. I'm not losing to this trash, dude. something to be brave about, bitch. <coughs> bitch, keep fucking playing with me. Killer sided my fucking ass. You ain't going nowhere.
Hatch spawns so close to the swing door, hits her in the face. <laughs> and all right. Yeah, like, what the fuck, dude? <coughs> that, that wasn't even fun. That was fucking irritating. <coughs> People want jaw. <laughs> People want Jaws on Killer. What the fuck? How are you gonna put Jaws in this game? Like, a shark swimming through the air? <laughs> like, I'm sorry, but that's just stupid. Windows of Opportunity as always. Borrowed, Iron, Kindred, D DS. Bite the bullet as always. Boon as always. Object, questionable, but yeah. Dead Heart as always, Iron Wind Windows as always, Resilience as always, Boon as always, Windows as always, Detectives Hunch and Kindred. <clears throat> it would be badass. Even the trash survivors using Dead Heart that should say something. Yes, exactly. Like, dude, <coughs> those survivors were terrible. And they still got me to like, what, one gin? Even the trick, yeah, um, all right. All right, once again, let me grab something real quick and, and we will continue this. Okay. All right, and I am back. <clears throat> so, is the build still holding up? Adept Trapper. Does everybody think the build is still holding up? against a legacy oh it's a TTV got it <clears throat> yeah that one is def he the TTV in here more than likely knows someone they usually don't come alone. God damn, for a killer sided map, survivors damn sure want to go to it. I find that kind of funny. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> throat> 
just a little funny to me that they say that the game is a killer sided map. <clears throat> we've we've got survivors choose the map two times in a row. <clears throat> it's a solo queue. Okay. A solo uh, TTV. Got it. That's good to know. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what these survivors do. Let's see what map it gives me. Why don't you give me area crows? I'm calling it. Now the game. They brought the offering. It'll give them the game. The fuck am I saying? <clears throat> All right. Let's see what they do on the game. Painful solo cues in his title. <laughs> oh my God. <clears throat> This dude's used to getting garbage. Well, that tells me a lot. Damn it. Didn't get to use it. Not there. Sorry. That's what I got to say about that is, ooh. <clears throat> ooh. Don't mind if I do. Wait a minute. Yay, they gave me good, they gave me good R RNG for scourge hooks. for it. <clears throat> oh, 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 that feels so beautiful. That feels beautiful. Good God. That fucking crutch ass perk, dude. I swear to God, it saves everybody. Well, I just fucked myself. That's a gin. God damn it. Get over there. Fuck. Come on, come on, come on. Move, move, move. Yes, pain resonance. Come here. Okay. Were they even working on a gin? Oh, they were.
not working on that. Boy, that trap. <laughs> Trash has it. Boy, it really sucks when you gotta rely on a perk to make a fucking ability good. That's why I love class photo, baby. Block all that shit. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <clears throat> Damn, I love it. I love it. 
Well, well, hello there. Now you come back here. There we go. Wait, she's going for the save. Thank you. Oh, damn it. No, she gets off. Oh. Now you can. Well then. Oh, never mind. using stick to agent combined with insta hill that TTV was annoyed with the fang and just staring at you <laughs> uh <laughs> that was fun that was actually kind of funny <laughs> yeah i know right i'm actually having fun with my killer we can't have that Next thing you know, Freddy gets hit with, like, what, the 20th nerf? The 20th uh, nerf? Let's see what they were using. 
Circle of Healing is always off the record. D DS and Lucky Break. Yep. Windows is always. Dead Heart is always. Distortion. Potential Energy. Adrenaline is always. Windows is always. Life is always. Bond. Off the record. Adrenaline. Dead Heart. And Windows as always. <clears throat> <laughs> that match was actually kind of funny with that fake man like literally just staring at me and I was just like just stared back and just like Psh. <laughs> they greed the gin knowing the teleport is coming then just stare at you when you get there <laughs> oh man like that that match was funny I'm not gonna lie <laughs> <clears throat> so what does everybody think what do you th what do you think about the build is it official is this the dream master build is this the dream master build you say it's legit No one more one match will be silver. <clears throat> this might be this might be a three man. Wouldn't surprise me. It's the dream deity build, <laughs> the dream demon build. Yeah, really. Fang, Meg, and Jeff. Yeah, could be. Yeah, I think I think you're right. I definitely think you are right. They bled a they brought a bloody party streamer and a white ward. <clears throat> so obviously somebody's using something good. <clears throat> Alright, let's see how it goes. Holy shit. After this match, I gotta switch batteries. Hey, what's up, Kevin? It's all right, man. You know, I'm glad you showed up. Wage do a big ear Freddy build. <laughs> right. <clears throat> all right, let's see how this match goes. Let's see what map we get. Okay, how's the build doing? It's I've won more than I've lost. The only time I've really lost is versus like an official coordinated four man. Yet, yeah. oh come on! Damn it! I almost got away with it. Ah. Oh, that slowed her down a little bit. This is going to be a dead hard. Or not. Thank you for the stack, by the way. And showing me what you look like so I know what to look for. Oh! 
ho, 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 ho. Big, big brain moment. I didn't even realize my obsession was there. What the fuck? Wait. Hey, how you doing? Oh, Jeff is my obsession. Okay. It switched my obsessions. Pain resonance, baby. Let's go. Okay. Just who I was looking. No. Yes. No! All right, at least I got my stack back. <laughs> what are these survivors doing? Oh, hey. And tink. Sexy beast. Wow, I fucked that up. I don't know what these survivors are doing. <laughs> hey, how you doing?
<laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. Hey, how you doing? Excuse me? Ex fucking excuse me? How in the fuck? How did she switch? Oh yeah, she stunned me. That made her my obsession. Okay, there we go. That is a okay. <laughs> I don't know what this match is, but I like it. Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. Y'all want to be funny. We can be funny. Better slam it. Oh, now that is sexy. Oh my goodness. Oh. I thought she was going to fall for it. Some of these perks will get nerfed. Bro, how are they gonna nerf these perks? These perks have been here for like a long time. 
And they've already nerfed the shit out of uh, some of these perks. Fine. Might as well get it over with. It was fun while it lasted. Alright. Thank you for the stack, by the way. Thank you. Terribly timed dead hard. That's got to be resilience. match killer OP please nerf <laughs> like dude what the hell did I just play Let's see what they were using. Dead Heart as always, de Decisive, Boon as always, Unbreakable as always, Dead Heart, Flashbang, Iron Will, Resilience, I knew it, Blood Pack, Hope, Soul Guard, and Dead Heart. Built the last for the people. Yeah, okay. If they were trying to troll, that's a one hell of a failed troll. <laughs> like, good God, that was such a failed troll. It was just a, f it was just fun messing around match. That's what's needed every once in a while. For a nerf perk, people sure do use dead hard. I know that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, you know, if you haven't noticed, we've had it every single game for it to be such a trash nerfed perk every everybody damn sure seems to be using it to everyone in this chat if you mean a bad killer and want their adept wait for the new system to come out that is very true I think this is the Freddy build I've been looking for. I honestly think this is the build I've been looking for. Yeah, I think this is the one too until it gets nerfed. 
I didn't want to. I did not want to make an eruption build. For the simple fact is, I know every all the survivors are crying about it, so I know Daddy's never gonna say no, and it will get nerfed. For what reason, I have no idea. You know, maybe if survivors didn't three gen themselves, then maybe that perk would lose its value. Yeah, that's why I don't. That's why I never made any uh, builds with it, with uh, Call of Brine or uh, Eruption, because I know it's gonna get nerfed into the dirt. More than likely, I'm thinking Call of Brine's the one that's gonna get uh, Tombstone. Holding a three gen with Eruption is powerful only because survivors, you know, put you in a position of power. Other than that, that perk is garbage, in my opinion. It's situational. I mean, it's not bad, but I definitely think there's better builds than Call of Brian. Holy shit, I gotta switch batteries. All right, Raccoon City again. All right, so I spawned over here. They could still be above me. I know they're gonna wanna take out the middle. All right. And we're off to a good start. I'm not going to stay on this dude's trail for long because I know where they are. If he came from that direction, I know exactly where they are. Okay. Well, there's, that's something. Oh, give it to me. I knew they wanted the fucking middle. I knew they wanted that middle gin out of the way. <laughs> All right, I need holy shit. Oh my god. I was I wasn't looking at my screen and I was trying to go up there. Nah, she's trying to take me away from the gins. Okay. So now they're switching the maps on switching sides. Okay. 
You fucking... You ain't about to sabo this one, motherfucker. get to the middle. I heard his... I need to leave him alone. They know each other, and their body, they're staying together. Wait, what? Hold, how in the fuck did she dead hard that? I would love to know how she fucking dead hearted that. Boy, if that ain't some bullshit. Bro, what? How? How did she get that twice? Bro, nah, dude. I'm calling bullshit on that, dude. Like, I'm not gonna say it's impossible, but I'm kinda calling bullshit. Like, That's exactly why I did that. 
Did she have a mid kit? I mean, it could it could have been a mid kit into a dead hard, maybe. It might have been. It was just really weird to me. I could it might have been metal a man med kit dead hard something Does he, does she have object of obsession? She does. <laughs> All right, anyway, as I was trying to do. All right, bitch, you've served your purpose. regressing let me guess he's gonna wait for her to die on hook or not oh don't tunnel let me guess don't tunnel but yet you want to body block him with off the record she wants to body block him with off the record and tells me not to camp not to tunnel That's kind of rich. All right, let me, hello. Damn, I love that movement speed, baby. Okay, so she went and hid. Yep, she's gonna go for the hatch.
Exactly what I was waiting for. This one. I'm gonna get ya. <laughs> GG. Yes, I am in I am loving the speed man Absolutely loving it Hey, there's that Dead heart as always Reassurance life unbreakable as always botany adrenaline as always spot spine chill sprint burst Prove thyself as always. Boone as always. Windows as always. Lithe and Bond. Fire up should give movement speed. Maybe what? Well, maybe by one percent. That's about it. That's about as far as I would go with it. Is one percent per generator. That's that's as far as it should go. Yeah, so <clears throat> Question to my chat Is this the Freddy build we've been looking for question to the chat Is this the build we've been looking for So many perks and people don't have fun trying some new stuff. Yes, bro. Bro, this build is beast mode. Like, absolutely beast mode. Like, you may not win every single game, but bro, I think we've won more than enough. Like, straight up. The Freddy build, man. I think we finally found it. <laughs> and it feels really good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is basically going to be all for this video. If you like the video, then please give me a like, comment, subscribe to the channel, share the video, hit that notification bell, and as always, I will see you in my next video.